it's time to get fluent and add some context to Jordan. Never got to the second round before Scotty. Well, Scotty got to the semis, the second round, without Jordan. It's true. It's factual. Let's add some context. Jordan didn't make it to the second round in years one, a rookie. Year two, he missed 65 games. Year three, true. Um, worst. Take a look at the roster, though. It was horrible. In years one, two, and three, he didn't make it. In year four, he did make it to the second round. Hence, Scotty was on that team. He was a rookie, started zero games, averaged less than 10 points per game. And, uh, yeah, that wasn't the reason they made it to the second round. However, that's the equivalent of saying LeBron James didn't make it to the playoffs without Larry Hughes because in years one and two, the Cavs missed the playoffs. Not until year three when they add Larry Hughes, they make the playoffs. I wouldn't say that, would you? Here's the other piece of the puzzle that you seem to be missing. The team that Scotty took to the second round, that Bulls team, was a three-peat championship team. Everybody on the team was there. Everybody on the team was healthy, with the exception of Michael Jordan. But they added Steve Kerr, Tony Kukoc, and Luke Longley to a three-time championship team. And yeah, they made it to the second round. Ooh, big deal. Now you're more fluent. 